the procedure is like this. I am going to integrate the hydraulic system of the passarella with the hydraulic system of, uh, of uh, the garage door, the uh, hydraulic system of uh, the bow thrusters, uh, the, the hydraulic system of uh, uh, the steering system, all the hydraulic system integrated. I am going to size the capacity of the electric motor and the capacity of the pump. The capacity of the electric motor in kilowatts and the capacity of the pump in gallons per hour in order to calculate how much pressure I need in total in the supply manifold and how much pressure I need in total in the return manifold. And now I am going to connect, I am going to connect in, the, in this way. That's the pump. The pump suction the oil from the tank, from the reservoir, and the pump pump it with high pressure the, the fluid into, into the supply manifold. Ah, because this is the high pressure line, I have a pressure regulator over there. That pressure regulator is used to keep the pressure constant in the supply manifold. Okay, right now I have pressure here in the supply manifold. And now I can connect different equipment. In this particular board, I have those sequential valves. Those are the, the, the body of valves. This is the input of the fluid and this is the return of the fluid. Okay, let me explain the procedure to connect those sequential valves. I prepare hoses with the same color, the same color in both sides. This is black with yellow, black with yellow. All right, I am going to connect one of these in the bottom with one valve and the other end for this actuator. And the other one will be connected here at the other end of the actuator. And right now, it's supposed that the actuator is running. Let me, let me start. I start the pump. And now the actuator up, down, down, up, up, and down. Okay. <laughs>